While the world continues to debate wind and solar, a quiet revolution is gaining momentum in the nuclear space, and New Scale Power, trading under the ticker SMR, could be leading the charge. New Scale isn't just another energy stock, it's pioneering small modular reactors, compact, factory-built nuclear units that could provide scalable, carbon-free power around the world. In a global energy landscape desperate for both security and decarbonization, this innovation could be a game-changer. If you're hunting for the next major disruptor in clean energy, don't overlook this one. Hit that subscribe button because SMR might just be one of the boldest long-term plays on the market right now. New Scale Power is the trailblazer in commercial small modular reactor technology. Founded in 2007 and headquartered in Oregon, it became the first and only company to receive U.S. Nuclear Regulatory Commission design certification for its SMRs. Its 50-megawatt electricity reactor was approved in 2022, followed by an upgraded 77-megawatt electricity model certified just last month. Unlike traditional reactors that require enormous infrastructure and produce over 1,000 megawatt electricity, New Scale's SMRs are factory built, about 65 feet tall, and designed for flexibility. These modular units can be deployed individually or in groups, allowing utilities to scale power output as needed, ideal for both urban grids and remote regions. Government support is strong. The U.S. Department of Energy has committed over $1.4 billion to New Scale's development, bolstered further by incentives in the Inflation Reduction Act. Internationally, Romania is moving forward with an SMR deployment, with construction likely beginning in 2025. Tech giants like Microsoft, Amazon, and Google are also exploring SMRs as reliable, carbon-free power sources for their growing data infrastructure. New Scale's technology isn't theoretical, it's certified, backed by public funds, and actively being integrated into real-world energy strategies. Wind and solar are growing fast, but their intermittent nature remains a challenge. They don't generate electricity when the wind dies or the sun sets, leaving gaps in power supply. That's where SMRs come in. They offer reliable, around-the-clock power, acting as the perfect complement to renewables. Traditional nuclear plants are expensive, require vast amounts of land, and take over a decade to build. SMRs, on the other hand, are compact and modular, enabling faster deployment and easier integration into existing grids. They can be placed near urban centers or remote areas, reducing the need for costly transmission lines and backup storage. In short, SMRs provide a stable, scalable, and carbon-free power source, solving key pain points that wind, solar, and large-scale nuclear currently face. New Scale Power isn't just a promising energy company, it's the first mover in a space with enormous long-term potential. Its biggest edge? Full regulatory approval for not one, but two reactor designs. This gives New Scale a competitive moat in a sector where approvals can take a decade or more. The company is actively moving toward commercialization. The NRC's recent approval of the 77-megawatt electricity design allows for greater flexibility and makes its offering even more appealing to utility partners. The Utah Associated Municipal Power Systems project, although now canceled, laid the foundational groundwork for future deployments. International growth is also picking up. In Romania, New Scale is working on what could be Europe's first SMR plant, backed by $4 billion in US and European financing. Poland, Jordan, and the Czech Republic are also exploring SMR integration, with MOUs and feasibility studies in progress. Altogether, New Scale is forging a truly global footprint in clean nuclear power. What truly sets New Scale apart is its engineering. Unlike conventional reactors, New Scale's modules are built in factories, reducing on site construction time and cost. Once delivered, the modules are installed in underground pools and cooled using natural circulation, requiring no pumps valves, or external power, a major advancement in safety. These reactors are also dynamic. Each unit can adjust its output down to 40%, enabling seamless integration with fluctuating renewable sources. That's a huge advantage in a grid dominated by solar and wind. New scale isn't just about nuclear, it's about nuclear that's safer, scalable, and ready for the modern energy grid. That technical edge adds even more weight to the stock's investment case. New Scale's financials suggest it's transitioning from a research company to a commercial enterprise. 
The first quarter 2025 saw revenue spike from $1.4 million the previous year to $13.4 million. Operating expenses came in at $42.3 million, down from $44 million the year prior, helping narrow its losses. Importantly, the company has no debt and over half a billion dollars in cash, giving it roughly two years of runway to continue scaling and securing new contracts. Still, with growing analyst coverage from major firms like UBS and Goldman Sachs and increasing global visibility, SMR has all the makings of a high-risk, high-reward play in the clean energy space. Despite setbacks like the cancellation of the UAM's pilot in Idaho, NewScale continues to build momentum. The failure was a setback in execution, but not in technology. In fact, it served to validate the platform while highlighting the need for more realistic deployment planning. The next big milestone is Romania's preliminary investment decision, expected in 2025. Backed by $4 billion in financing, it would mark Europe's first SMR deployment. Poland is also advancing a 462-megawatt Electricity 6 module project, slated for completion by 2029. These developments could turn SMR from a niche U.S. tech firm into a global clean energy powerhouse. While the promise is big, the road is difficult. Regulatory reviews remain extensive even after design certification. Each deployment requires site-specific approval, which can delay construction by years. Cost is another challenge. The terminated Idaho project ballooned from $3.6 billion to over $9 billion, proving that even modular designs are not immune to cost overruns. Public skepticism around nuclear energy, no matter how advanced, can also lead to political hurdles and policy reversals. New scale is pushing the boundaries of nuclear innovation, but it still faces execution risk, regulatory delays, and capital-intensive build-outs. These are not minor obstacles, they're core risks for any investor to weigh. SMR stock is a fascinating play on the future of clean energy. It's the only company with NRC-certified SMR designs, a growing pipeline of global deals, and meaningful government backing. But it's also burning cash, still pre-profit and vulnerable to delays and dilution. Is it a once-in-a-decade opportunity or just another SPAC with a futuristic vision and a long road ahead? New Scale Power stands at the intersection of innovation, necessity, and geopolitical strategy. If it executes on its vision, it could redefine nuclear energy as modular, mobile, and green. But investors will need conviction and patience. Are you ready to bet on Nuclear 2.0? Let us know in the comments. Like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell for more deep dives into high potential clean tech, from hydrogen to renewables to the next big breakthrough. Thanks for watching Stocks Telegraph, where we cover tomorrow's themes today.